Hello you lovelies, welcome to the channel, it's Rad and after about a couple of years of break I am back with another set of videos and uh, these videos are going to be for uh, the week of 8th to 14th of April just let me make sure, yeah it is uh, from 8th to uh, 14th of April 2024 and they will refer to your star signs. Uh, this reading is going to refer to your star signs, so bear that in mind. And while you can use its information uh, to your own discretion, use it as a guidance, as advice. Uh, they may not 100% reflect to your personal situations. If you do wish me to read for your personal situations, you can always go to my website, a uh, link of which you will find in the description down below. There at the very front page you will see full list of my services and as well their pricing. And based on your budget and as well your needs, you can go for uh, whichever one suits you best. So with that said and without further ado, let's jump straight away to the videos. What we have on our hands now, uh, that will be Aries, and I'm going to use a couple of systems, although Tarot is going to be uh, the main course. The first system that I'm going to use is going to show us a uh, event, a, a situation that will happen to you, an important situation that will happen to you, and this is what the Tarot reading is going to revolve around, and I'm doing that just so I can be uh, a bit more specific. And so the cards which are defining your situation, Aries, are as follow. Those three. So we do have the heart, the star, and the sight. Uh, I should draw one more card to the sight. So this a lot like look, okay? Uh, the situation and the event is whether finding a way how to manifest your feelings, your love, or a finding a way of uh, midst of a, a, a difficult situation when it comes to uh, um, your love life. Or kind of like resolving a conundrum within, uh, within your love life. So that is something important that is going to happen to you and what's going to come out of it. Uh, we are going to check right now with, uh, with the tarot cards. So let me shuffle here really quick I'm even rusting the in the riffle all right so what's gonna come out of it the cards we have are as nine of uh, wands first one uh, four of cups which is the second and then the third one, that will be the Ace of Cups, okay? This is an Elemental Dignity Technique, so all these cards, they do form a uh, collective community message in regards to it. And they are going to be most general, uh, generous, I'm sorry, not general, but generous. Or this week, 8th to 14th of April, is going to be the most generous uh, generous for uh, those areas of you that are a single. And actually, the conundrum and the problem in your love life, as the uh, situation, it is a finding a mate, okay? Just finding a mate. And uh, what Tarot points is that such is going to appear, such mate is going to find you, rather, uh, instead. Now, uh, by the look of them, and I'm going to show them to you one more time, so these uh, these three cards, by the look of them, uh, and you guys are going to hate me for uh, for saying that, but, but the, the, the biggest portion of the guilt or the blame, why mate cannot be found, uh, resides within you. Now, what kind of a, a blame it is uh, to bestow upon you? Well, that differs, you know, character. It differs in, in terms of preferences and whatnot that you do have. And that's why, instead of you finding one, uh, it's going to end up one finding you. And now that makes a lot much sense here, that side with the fourth card, which is the clover. From the other uh, from the other system because the clover stands for 
multiple but rather small gains okay and the site cuts that so instead of you having multiple but a small gains like an options available in terms of whether uh, dating in terms of whether uh, uh, flirting with multiple people but having no gains literally no substantial gains out of it this option is taken away from you and instead it is decided for you that you're going to have just only one option at least for this week whether you take it or not is entirely up to you right but you will have only one option and the gains from it are going to come about now talking about that option here with uh with these tarot cards there is a lot of uh, discomfort that is going to settle around the, the, the this conundrum or this uh, situation that you're going to end up with having been chosen right uh, by a person that shows a significant interest in you and the discomfort is going to be because of this um, Ace of Cups that sits next to the Nine of uh, Wands, right? Uh, those two cards that we do have here. <coughs> Excuse me. They represent active, uh, active enemies. And it stands for either that this individual shows up in a rather <coughs> unconvenient time for you. So you do have so many other things to do that you can't actually cannot devote uh, the desired time into uh into this endeavor so you can see where it's going right or it could happen that it is unfortunately a person that you do currently not like or let's say you have no feel to it whatsoever you don't know what to make of it right uh, it doesn't catch your eye immediately that individual and so on and so forth so it will it will come a lot to that are you willing to give a chance this time around okay there is no head start here there is no handicap either but are you willing to just try it out and see where it's going and if you do so for what these cards here are showing oh i don't want to sound dramatic but it does look like that the whole new world is going to open to you i mean this this individual has a a whole new world to offer to you and again, the choice is yours, whether you take it or not, this opportunity comes about, but whether you take it or not, up to you. Now, for those of you who are in a, uh, who are in a relationship, because that will affect you as well, uh, although the situation is going to be slightly different, and that is a, a way out of a, like I said at the start of this reading, difficult conundrum within your love life, within your relationship. And unfortunately, uh, the option that gives you that is going to be something that you, uh, is going to be an option that you will dislike. Uh, it's just it's going to repose you right away, okay? Knowing that you will have to take down that path, uh, you got to take take that choice whatsoever but also it will be undeniable that simply is going to work whether that is a compromise that you will have to make whether that is a an apology that you will have to give although you feel that you aren't guilty of anything and and so on and so forth but if you do want your uh, plight in your love life in your family in your relationship to be resolved sometimes we gotta do what we gotta do whether you are gonna do it or not again your choice and so with that said guys this is uh, your aries reading hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it and if you do so please consider subscribing to the channel uh, leave a like to the video and hopefully we're going to see each other next time until then bye